chief petty officers and first class petty officers assigned to aircraft carrier USS Harry S. Truman participated in a community service project aboard the decommissioned battleship Wisconsin in downtown Norfolk, April 12th. The Truman sailors spent more than four hours cleaning and restoring a chief petty officer berthing that had not been used in more than 20 years. It's a great opportunity because we're actually getting to work on a U.S. ship um, and we're bringing back CPO spaces back to life. That's a lot of the spaces that are deep down and people don't always get to see them um, and people always want to know how the, the upper ranks live. Um, so it's a really good opportunity um, to bring both first classes and the chief's messes together and to bring the ship back to life. In conjunction with the Navy's CPO 365 training program, the Community Service Project provided participating first classes the chance to work alongside chiefs aboard the historic Navy vessel. This is a lot of dust in here. And, uh, it just tells you how dirty a ship can get if no one tends to it. You know, we got to do zones every day, so, so it's important that you get inside your burdens and clean from top to bottom. Meyer said he was proud to restore a piece of naval history and hopes future visitors will appreciate a cleaner Wisconsin. So it's like me giving back to uh, CPOs all over again, so it's a pleasure. Uh, well, one, it keeps the, um, the Navy presence and the Navy image strong in the community, um, specifically the Truman. Uh, we already have a really great name out in the community, and it just shows that we are committed to the community as much as the community, uh, the community is committed to us, um, as supporting us and the military, and we just want to show our appreciation and show how much we appreciate that their efforts and their works for us. Aboard USS Harry S. Truman, I'm Petty Officer Taylor B. Martino.